John, even with the rain, tonight is a night where law enforcement and firefighters hold their breath and pray that nothing major happens. Fire Danger has 10 different agencies patrolling the Albuquerque area, especially along the Bosque and at all those different fireworks shows tonight. News 13's Nancy Laughlin is live at Isotopes, Parks, Isotopes Park with more on that. Nancy? Tim, there are a lot of fans out here, of course, and the ball players, but there are also a lot of firefighters out here at Isotopes Park. That's because, as you said, there's a huge fireworks show that's going to happen any minute. And we spent the day with firefighters and other emergency crews who are up in the air and on the ground trying to keep you safe. This is a day these people spend many days planning for. It is early afternoon. Firefighters and law enforcement are working together, ready for the worst, hoping for the best. On the ground, they patrol the boss game, a wooded area with a history of fire troubles. If we have some type of escalated incident, we'll uh, send all the resources to it, hoping to uh, contain it, confine it, put it out early, and, and get ready for the next one, opposed to it escalating into a large scale incident. Multiple crews on the ground get help from deputies above them. The Bernalillo County Sheriff's Department's air unit keeps a close eye on the Bosque, too. We're not on a call, we're looking for fires along the Bosque, and we're oftentimes the first one to spot them. And from the air, you can spot a lot. We see people enjoying the fourth, even playing volleyball in the river. There are also more firefighters and law enforcement in the river, too, on boat. Right now, it is calm. Sheriff's deputies want it to stay that way. I think for me personally is making sure that nobody on the ground gets hurt. We don't want our firefighters and law enforcement officers to get hurt or any citizens to, to come in the way of something like that. On a day when most Americans get a break, that is not the case for the Albuquerque fire chief. In addition to all the regular 911 calls, there are three huge fireworks shows tonight, including the one at the Topes. And then as soon as the game ends, we'll have an engine company where they light off the fireworks just behind uh, center field. He and his staff are coordinating operations here and throughout the city. The department is fully staffed. How nerve-wracking is the 4th of July for you all? Well, what, what Christmas is to Santa Claus, the 4th of July is to firefighters. That's right, you all. A very busy night for firefighters. They're also manning these uh, fireworks hotlines. And right now, right behind me, the fireworks show just started. It's a great way to end the 4th. And I'm sure that the firefighters are keeping a close eye on this, too. Tim, back to you. Enjoy the show, Nancy. Thank you very much. The chief says no major glitches so far.